Von Bernon al Nask in three, two, uno. Von Bernon al Nask! Hello and welcome to Nask. Today I am at the Nord America Sumera Cursaro de Esperanto. I'm at the North American Summer Courses of Esperanto at William Peace University in Raleigh, North Carolina. And I just wanted to show you around in English what the place is like and what the atmosphere is like and give you a few tips for if you were to decide to come next year. First tip I'm going to give you, I wish I had remembered this, is the bedding that they provide here is pretty paltry. Uh, it's one pillow one dinky little blanket and then a not fitted sheet that just you wake up in the middle of the night and half of your body is on just plastic. It's bad. I had to steal a secondary blanket from an empty room upstairs. I, I'm an idiot for not remembering. Yep, you have to bring a fitted bed sheet with you if you want to stay put. Uh, I've used like clothespins before on, on the, it's just, it's weird that they don't have better bedding, but hey, small price to pay to be around a bunch of awesome Esperanto speakers. Let's get out of here. We just finished our last day of classes, and uh, we're gonna have supper in a little bit, and then we're having our Diplomija Ceremonio, the diploma ceremony, where everyone gets a little certificate for all the hard work they did. And here are some fun folks. Hello. And they're hanging out in the lobby area here. This is where a lot of fun happens. So we've got a little like bookstore of sorts with some new uh, children's books and, and whatnot uh, that, that you can purchase that are Esperanto in nature. Mi pardon pretas pro lo crocodilado. Pardon pretas. Pardon pretas. Mi estis preta. Pardoni mi. Pardon pretas. Yes, so uh, there's a great film about NOSC that's in Esperanto that was made several years ago. I'll, set, I'll put some links in the video description below so you can check those out. That's in Esperanto with Esperanto subtitles, but just for people who are not that far into it yet, here's basically what we're up to. Uh, so we've got this room, Hans is in here, Brianno is in the other room. He's got a printer in there for printing up worksheets for classes and whatnot uh, that we work on throughout the week. And let me walk around and show you the campus a little bit. So this is a beautiful campus. It's kind of a loud campus though with all of the air conditioners on full blast all day. Uh, we kicked off the new uh, Esperanto Film Festival, the Usona Bona Film Festivalo. And there's beautiful locations here to film, but it's tough finding a place that's not super loud with all of these huge air conditioners here. So because of the air conditioner on the first floor of the dormitory here, we had to film way upstairs in the third floor common room for, for a couple of our films there. This campus has plenty of places to just hang out, enjoy nature, work on your homework uh, between classes, but you really do keep busy here. There's always another event going on, a lecture that's about to be given on something. Gary did a, a presentation about his uh, trip to Hawaii and talked about the Hawaiian language and how it's different and similar to English and Esperanto and how you build words and how uh, you know, the meanings of names are, are put together, which is really fascinating. Margo did uh, some presentations on origami, which were fun to do. And and then every night we have our gufuyo, the, the owl nesting place, where we hang out, we drink tea, we have cookies and snacks, and we play board games, usually Cartoy contra Esperantuyo, which is cards against Esperanto land, uh, where it's all saucy and appropriate things that are like inside jokes for Esperanto speakers. Uh, but here's the cafeteria building where the downstairs is where we eat and then the upstairs is where we have games and, and tennis and whatnot and so there's always a lot of fun things to do in there it's so loud out here though let me just get us indoors so you bring these little cards around your your badges and that way you can get into the different buildings uh, throughout the week and you can lock your individual uh, bedrooms with a old-fashioned metal key as well so you can have your things secured Holden, hello there. I'm just showing a little 
bit of what Nosk is like. This is just a, a fun place to hang out and explore. We've got three class levels. There's the post baza, the post beginner level, the middle medium level, and then there's the supera or advanced level courses where you learn at various uh, levels of difficulty and levels of fluency. And we play games and we do challenges. And we have homework that we'll work on throughout the week. We have breakfast then a morning session of classes, then lunch, then an afternoon session of classes, and then some free time, and then supper, and then some more free time. And during the free time sessions, there's optional lectures and excursions into the city to enjoy. And then at the end of the week, we usually have a distra vespero. Because this year we're missing a lot of uh, our regulars like Derek and Elena and Licio who often will put things together and, and align things. We, we didn't have one of those this year, but after launching the, the film festival, I think we've had four or five teams already running around and making films and recording films, getting the footage here while we have Esperanto speakers to quickly act in your films and improvise in your films, and we can always edit the footage later. In fact, Holden uh, just acted in one uh, for Barbara uh, yesterday that uh, I helped out with as well, and we had a good time, and it was kind of fly by the seat of your pants and just, oh, okay, great, are you done now? All right, now, now help my team make mine. So that was fun, and I'm, the plan is to have the film festival going on again during NOSC next summer. It'll also, the current one is going on now. Check the links in the video description below, and you'll, you'll see more about that. We made an announcement video and posted that on the Esperanto USA page. So that's something you can do even without driving anywhere from afar. You can participate in our film festival, but we'd love to see you here at NOSC next year. And the more the merrier. It really has been wonderful seeing so many fresh new faces who had never spoken Esperanto before this week, and now they're having fun and laughing and cracking jokes during, you know, playing a board game and playing tennis and all that stuff. It's, it's a fantastic place to be, and we'd love to have you join us. Thanks for watching, and have a wonderful day. Patrons, thank you for your support in making this film and for helping people explore Esperanto.